Welcome back to my channel. My name is Stella Rose and today we are doing cash stuffing of my sinking funds and this binder contains my savings challenges. I hope you guys have been having a really good week um, and good weekend. I can't believe Christmas is almost here. The, t the day that this video is going up is Sunday and then Monday it is one week. One week, I repeat, until Christmas. Can you believe it? Oh my gosh, because I cannot. Okay, so I have $200 here. Um, I cannot find my little cheat sheet where I had everything going. So it's kind of gonna be like a little winging it kind of thing. Um, so we're just gonna go ahead and get started. I only have 20s, 10s, 5s, and 1s. So we are going to just wing it. I am going to start with my savings challenges though because with my savings challenges I really want to complete those and I want to make sure I have the correct denominations because that's the one I'm most worried about because some of my sinking funds um, in these other binders, I don't need to stuff. So the savings challenges are kind of like my priority that I don't remember what I've stuffed in here or what I was going to stuff in here. So let's go ahead and just start. I know I was going to stuff like all of the savings challenges. So first and foremost, we have my $500 savings challenge. This one is from Mystic Budgets. And I have a lot of them already colored in, but that's not what I actually have in here because I had to restart. Um, so I'm going to stuff this 15 that's right here. So I'll grab a 10 and a 5. And we are just going to add it in here. And with you guys, I am not going to count it, I don't believe. Or should I count it? I don't know. Should I count it? Okay. I, you know what? I'm going to count it because I usually count. So it's going to like throw me off if I don't. So we have 20, 40, 50, 60, 75, 80, 81, 2, 3, 4, 85. $85 in my 500 challenge. And I will keep up with my trackers later. I'm going to do it right this second with you guys. Um, savings challenge. I'm pretty sure I did a five for the cactus challenge. So let's grab a five. So yeah, five, 10, 15, 20, one, two, three, four, and 25. All right. Doing pretty good on that one. This one saves a hundred dollars. Next is the soda pop challenge. I honestly don't remember what I stuffed in here. And it might have been five or it might have been eight. Uh, I mean, eight or three. Sorry, my bad. So I'm going to just put three in here. So one, two, and three. And now we have five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, and seventeen. So 17 in the soda pop challenge. Now, honestly, if I have an extra five left over after all this, I'm like from what I know I was going to stuff or like 100% know I was gonna stuff, it'll just go somewhere. I'm not sure where. Um, I'm pretty sure I stuffed three fives and a 10 in my December challenge. So we have one, two, three fives, and a 10. So we will now be at, sorry, and I have stuff playing in the background. Um, I was watching an organizational video on Christmas decluttering and <laughs> it's playing a commercial right now. So 10, 25, 35, and $40. So we are 60 away. This one also saves a 100 in the challenge binder. 
My savings challenges, this, this specific folder goes with all of these little scratchers from Mystic Budgets. I looked at her shop and she doesn't have these anymore and I'm kind of upset at it because I really liked these. Um, and I think I was gonna do the, the $3, yeah, that's right, because I just scratched that off. So we have one, two, three going in. And that is going to go into this. So we now have 10, 20, 30, 35, 6, 7, 8, 9, 40, 41 dollars. I don't know how much it saves. And once I'm done with this one, because I have one, two, three more scratchers to do. Once I'm done with this one, I'm going to take it out. And then I'm going to move on to this one, but keep everything in here. So once I'm done with all of these is when I will be done with these challenges. Okay, next is the 26 week, and I'm pretty sure I, stu I was stuffing the 35. So that is a 20, a 10, and a 5. And this one I am keeping track of because I don't want to be missing any money because somehow things have been coming up missing lately in my house and I'm not happy about it. So I've been keeping trackers on everything. Um, 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 40, 50, 60, 70, 85, 90. So 190, we are 10 away from $200 already. And this one saves, I believe, 1200. Yes, 1200. So we will be a thousand away from finishing. Um, the bronze challenge is my last challenge in here and I'm pretty sure I was gonna stuff the five. Um, let me just make sure it was just a five. So we have one, two, $30 and it would have been 40. Yep, okay. So $5, so we have 20, 35, and 40. Cause I'm trying to go down the line of the ones that I've already scratched and put those in. So then I'm going to move to the next line after I stuff $5 next week, or I could do 15 next week. I'm not, I'm not sure what I want to do. All right. So that is it for my savings challenges. Next, we're going to move into my sinking funds, which is this binder here. These are like my long-term ish. <laughs> I don't remember what I was going to stuff in my month ahead. I'm going to come back to that. Doggy stash. I'm pretty sure I was going to stuff $5. And so we'll put that there. So we have 5, 10, 15, 20, 1, and 2. So $22 in doggy stash. And then we're going to move on to vacation. And I put $5 in here. I'm pretty sure we want to go on a vacation, but we're just not sure what we want to do yet. Um, so there's just no point in saving big bundles of money. We don't have anything planned. Um, so 5, 10, 15, 20, and 25. I do know, however, that in June sometime, we are going to be going to, um, uh, what's it called? Florida. <laughs> We're going to the beach with my parents. So $10 is going into Avery. And the tracker is wrong on here because I decided to take out all their $2 bills because they were literally just sitting in there. And I'm going to be physically stuffing them next week for all of my sinking funds and savings challenges. But I'm going to actually put in what they were supposed to have. And that's why I'm not, um, I, I don't have the right amount. So it says 46. And I know, I know that's not right. So we have 20, 35, wow, 10, 20, 35, and 40. And if you can see, I have these old fives. So, okay. So that means Isaac will have the same because that is also what I'm stuffing in his. And I put an old five in Avery's because Isaac had an old five in his. Um, that he got from his grandpa during Easter. Okay, that's it for this one. Next, we are going to move into this pink binder with my Cheshire cat. If anybody knows anything about me, it's I love Cheshire cat. I have an Alice in Wonderland tattoo right here and I'm gonna be getting the Cheshire cat on this side. I'm gonna incorporate 
these two tattoos and I'm gonna hopefully get this covered because it's not gonna have anything to do with my Alice in Wonderland. So I'm gonna have to see what I can figure out to color right there or whatever. But nails, nails is getting 25. So that is a 20 and a five. And the only reason why it's getting so much is because I'm actually using it. These are my revolving funds. These are ones that I use. Um, so I don't want to spend money I don't want to use at the moment. So I was going to stuff tattoos. I canceled that. Um, I wasn't, I'm not, I'm not stuffing that, not stuffing. I don't think I'm stuffing anything else in here. Yeah. Okay. So it was just nails. And then I feel like I'm missing a lot because I have like a lot of fives here, but it's fine. We'll figure it out. So next we have birthdays and my birthday is coming up. It's the next one in April, but I don't know if I was stuffing it. I can't remember. Birthdays, I think I gave it something, but again, I don't remember because I don't have my darn thing. Family time, I believe is getting 15. I'm not sure. <laughs> I really wish I could find my sheet. I don't know what happened to it because I had it yesterday with my cash stuffing things. But then the other day, um, my son had drawn on the back of it, so whatever he drew. I don't even know what he drew. And he must have taken it. That's the only thing I can think of is that he actually took it and did something with it. Maybe it's in his room. But if I go into his room, it's literally going to wake up everybody in the house because my dog will start barking his head off. And it's only a little past 5 o'clock in the morning. 10, 20, 35, and 40. $40 in family time. I'm not sure what we're going to do. We might uh, do bowling or... Go to the city and get see a movie or something like that since we don't have um, a movie theater in town anymore, which is stupid. That's a whole other rant for another day. So $5 in kitties. We are at 10, 15, 25, and 30. 30 in kitties. I'm not sure what I'm going to use this one for. But it is always good to have because your kids want everything in the world. So, okay. Um, I can't remember. I feel like I was going to stuff things in here. Let's see what we have left. So we have 5, 10, 15, 25. 26, 7, 8, 9, 30, 1, 2, 3, 34. Okay, so I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 dollars in ones. And I think I said 25 in fives. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. So. Valentine's Day comes up next. I'll do a five, and this will be for, I'm going to take this out because there's nothing on there. Um, I think I'm going to get something probably for the kids for Valentine's Day, and then maybe some flowers for my wife. I'm not sure. We don't really celebrate Valentine's Day. We just get random flowers whenever we feel like it for each other, so... Okay, Mother's Day and Father's Day. Mother's Day comes first, so I'm gonna do a five in that one, and there's already a five, so we're at 10. And then Father's Day, I'm gonna give $2, because that's all the way in June, so this one has a five as well, so it'll have seven. And then Fourth of July, we absolutely love. We like to shoot off fireworks. Um, I'm gonna give it $2 because it's all the way in July. So $7 for that as well. And then I really would like to do fall slash Christmas photos this next year, starting like yearly. Um, so I'm gonna put a dollar in there. And I wasn't gonna stuff anything else. So 
We are gonna move back into the family binder and we'll stuff $5 in my birthday. I don't even know what's in here, 10. Okay, I have 15 then. And then birthdays we'll put, I don't know. We don't have any birthdays coming up until March besides my, oh, actually, my sister-in-law just had her birthday on the 14th. Forgot to tell her happy birthday. Happy birthday, sister-in-law. And then my father-in-law, we bought him a present, um, and his is on the 22nd. So, but $2 into birthdays. Um... I guess I'll put a dollar each into the kids' birthday. They can never have enough for their birthdays. Isaac's is in um, July, and then Avery's is in September. Wife's just just passed last month, so November 4th. So that's why she doesn't have anything in there. And Avery's, like I said, is September, so that's why she only has that dollar. Um, I guess I'm going to stuff a $5 into date night. We need to actually have time together. Um, so we have 25 now. And then I might put a five into the month ahead one because I wanted to stuff money in there, but I don't remember if I actually said that I was going to put money in there this week if, or if I crossed it off. So we will have $35. I know this was a quick stuffing for me. Sometimes normally I can go for like 30 minutes or whatever, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, before you leave, click subscribe. So that way you can get notified with that bell of the next time I upload a video. Um, I'm hoping to be able to do a shop my stash or something makeup related here soon. My desk is up in my bedroom and all my other stuff um, because we had foundation repair in our basement which is where I was going to be having my stuff so it's all down there um so until I can get all that stuff moved back down I can't do anything makeup related because I literally have no room to film or do anything in my room so I hope everyone has a wonderful day and remember to stay beautiful